My name is Josh Corey. I'm the co-director of Journey to Planet X, which follows two amateur filmmakers and real life scientists as they go about making an epic science fiction film. Um, we, we met them in 2002 when they submitted to our film festival, the Brooklyn Underground Film Festival, and uh, we rejected it that year because it didn't, we didn't really know what to make of the movies. Uh, but then I showed a lot of people and I ended up, we ended up inviting them to the festival the following year to take part. And after that, they just, you know, we always showed their work and that started that relationship that we had for about 10 years. 2007, we asked them if they were ever making anything new that, um, you know, we'd love to document it and they called us and said, yeah, we are. So that started that journey. I think um, the film is sort of, it's sort of a, a universal filmmaking process. Uh, I think that there are many different sizes of film productions from, you know, very, very small and amateur to, you know, really, you know, well done, expensive uh, independent films. But they all kind of follow that same process and they all kind of, there's, straw, there's highs and lows and, you know, we all feel that same fear and anxiety and, sh and frustration and that's seen in our film and that's, I think, a lot of filmmakers and artists will kind of respond to that. I think the difference is that um, we approached it from the position of not making fun of them, but more actually, I actually really do like their movies. I think they're great and I, I respect them more, definitely more now than I did, but I always respected them. But um, uh, I think that uh, because we take them seriously, we take them seriously. And I think a lot of people in the audience take them seriously too. Uh, they're just, they are funny. You know, their movies are funny and I don't feel bad saying that. And I don't mind telling them that, even if it's not intentional. Their, their movies are hilarious, but they're also charming. And they're also really kind of arty and strange in a way and, char you know, and just really, some Sometimes it's beautiful. It's so strange. It's like outsider art, you know what I mean? Because these guys are in their day lives, they're scientists and they're really smart. They're like geniuses. Um, but then in film world, they're just trying to make it work. And that's and at the same time, that's kind of like what we're all doing. You know, we're professionally trained or we're not. You know, what makes them, you know, silly or and than us, you know, or any filmmaker out there who's trying for the first time. We have a lot of first time filmmakers at Travers. And, you know, are they crazy or are they just doing their best with what they have? I hope that they connect with Troy and Eric, the two main characters. I, th I hope they'll connect with their passion and their drive. And I hope they think it's funny. You know, it's a funny, there's not enough funny movies in the world. There's not enough funny documentaries in the world. I was on a panel with uh, a lot of great people. Michael Moore was there as well. And he was talking about um, the need for more comedic work. And he's, uh, he's always like, I wish there was more great comedic work because that's, comedy is what helps sell you know, um, passion and, and help sell, uh, you know, uh, it, it's very digestible by an audience. And I think that you can say so much through comedy and, and bring, bring so many people into a cause or to an issue or to just, just general, you know, human nature. I think there's a lot of opportunities there. So make funny movies and make funny documentaries. I used to be a programmer and uh, I would have watched so many just dreary down, downer movies that had great content, but I was like, God, Somebody's got to make funny movies, and then I started making movies again, and I was like, I think I have to make funny movies, and that's sort of been my, my mission. There, uh, I, I had an ex incredible experience working with the Interlochen uh, filmmakers. I'm not going to say kids; uh, they're young, but uh, I mean they're they're terrific, and it was a lot of fun. I, I teach full, I teach at Pride Institute in, in Brooklyn, and. I fell in love with teaching because it's the old cliche, but it's totally true. You know, you learn more from your students than they learn from you, or, or just as much at least. I mean, you, I learned so much teaching um, through the experience of teaching, and I, I absolutely love it. I adore it. Um, and also, it makes me a sharper filmmaker because they ask me questions all the time, and I don't teach something if I don't understand it. So either I, either I don't show them how to do that, which is not my style, or I go learn it and I go learn how to do it really well and I present it to them. And I think that through that process, I've become a much better filmmaker and a storyteller and, you know, and passionate too. I mean, I love, I love young people making movies because when I was a kid, I was a pretty bad student and I didn't do anything very well and I was pretty much on my way to failure. And the, the one thing I could do was camera stuff, was film stuff, was be funny in front of a camera. And then a couple of years I, I just walked from in front of the camera to behind the camera and I never stopped. And 
it changed my life. You know, I'm a prof if you asked me, my parents at 18, if I would ever teach at a college level, they'd think you were insane because I was just I was just an awful, awful student, awful kid. Um, but I, it, it, it turned my life around. And if if other kids can find that something, whether it's film or art or anything, you know, this stuff is not just art. You know, it's 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 life changing stuff. I've wanted to come to the Traverse City Film Festival since it was birthed <laughs> eight years ago. And to finally be here is just amazing. Um, it's so great. The audiences are so awesome. The festival staff, and I'm not, not just saying that because I'm here. They're amazing. Like I keep, Miles and I, the co-director, keep saying like, this festival's amazing. And we're like getting sick of each other saying it. It's amazing. It's so cool. It's one of the best festival experiences I've ever had. It's been a blessing. And we're so proud to be here with this film. So thank you.